the last topic of your cell structure chapter is stem cells ye stem cells basically kya hote hain wo hum dekh lete hain many tissues in the human body contains small number of undifferentiated cells kuch cells aise bhi hote hain body mein jo ke undifferentiated hain which have not yet been specialized or which have not yet been undifferentiated these are called the stem cells and their function is to divide and produce new differentiated cells within the tissue for growth and repair ye stem cells kya karte hain ye emergency cells hote hain for example the number ab ye bilkul normal cells hain theek hai they have not been differentiated into anything now listen carefully let's say the muscle cells in your body reduce in number ye stem cells kya karenge they would start becoming muscle cells ye divide hona shuru ho jayenge and convert into muscle cells because aapki body ke andar muscle cells kam hai let's say aapki body ke andar red blood cells they reduce the number of red blood cells reduce in your body ye stem cells kya karenge they would start differentiating into red blood cells as well and same is the case with all the other cells so stem cell is one of a kind that can convert into any type that can convert itself into any kind of a differentiated cell that can convert into any kind of a specialized cell so stem cell kisi bhi cheez mein divide ho sakta hai these are called stem cells and their function is to divide in the function care to divide and produce new differentiated cells within the tissue for growth and repair for example adult stem cells from bone marrow are quite useful in medicine as they can be directed to differentiate into several different cell types so aap stem cells ko bahut se different cell types ke andar convert kar sakte hain they are free to be converted into any types aur yahi stem cells further divide ho sakte hain by mitosis into producing more and more stem cells of the same kind so ye basically aap bas idea hai of the stem cells stem cells are also found in great numbers in the embryonic tissue ye aapko kahan pe milenge inside the embryonic tissue and there is a large amount of development and differentiation going on during fetal development jo fetal development ho rahi hoti hai when the baby is being made inside the mother's womb jab aapka uterus ke andar we'll be doing this in reproduction chapter ke jab aapki mother ki womb ke andar fetal fetal ko na the baby being developed inside her body usko stem cells ki bahut zarurat hoti hai because doesn't the baby needs muscles usko कार्डियक सेल्स भी चाहिए उसको मसल सेल्स भी चाहिए उसको रेड ब्लड सेल्स भी चाहिए उसको ब्रेन सेल्स भी चाहिए उसको नर्व सेल्स भी चाहिए देयर एंड देन द स्टेम सेल्स हेल्प इन डिवाइडिंग एंड डिफरेंशिएटिंग इनटू मेनी डिफरेंट टोटीपोटेंट प्लूरीपोटेंट मल्टीपोटेंट एंड फुली डिफरेंशिएटेड सेल्स इसलिए उनको एम्ब्रियोनिक टिश्यू के अंदर बहुत लार्ज अमाउंट प्रेजेंट होते हैं बिकॉज़ दे हैव अ वेरी बिग रोल इन द एट मंथ डेवलपमेंट ऑफ द फीटस इनसाइड द मदर मदर के अंदर जो बेबी प्रोड्यूस हो रहा है that baby needs the cells usko har kisam ka cell chahiye to stem cell would also divide into nerve cells the stem cells would also divide into red blood cells har kisam ke cell ke andar wo divide ho jayenge scientists ne bhi ab ek tarika nikal liya scientists can clone these embryonic stem cells and direct them to differentiate into almost any cell type ab hame kya hai let's for example a patient comes aur usko ek organ chahiye ab organ banane ke liye hame cells chahiye ठीक है सेल्स टिश्यूज बनाएंगे टिश्यूज वुड मेक अप एन ऑर्गन सो इफ अ पर्सन नीड्स अ किडनी स्टेम सेल्स की मदद से ड्यू टू दी हेल्प ऑफ स्टेम सेल थेरेपी इन द मॉडर्न वर्ल्ड एंड इन द 21st सेंचुरी द साइंटिस्ट्स हैव एक्चुअली फाउंड अ वे टू प्रोड्यूस दीस ऑर्गन्स बाय मेकिंग टिश्यूज एंड टिश्यूज आर मेड फ्रॉम स्टेम सेल्स अगर किसी को एक किडनी चाहिए ठीक है वो ऑर्गन कैसे डेवलप हो रहे हैं साइंस इतनी आगे चली गई है that the scientists can use the stem cells to convert those cells into the one they need uh, the one differentiated cells those cells would be converted into tissues of kidney and finally you have a fully functioning organ known as kidney so scientists can also now clone clone ka matlab kya hai further divide and make many copies of the same type of stem cells and they can these uh, agar aap sin ki location puchi jaye to stem cells are found in the greatest number in bone marrow and in most number in the sabse largest number jo hai that is present in embryonic tissue and stem cells can differentiate into almost any cell type ek uh, ye bhi aata hai concept using stem cells in medicine that how are stem cells used in medicine advantages mein dekhte hain can be used to replace damaged cell let's say agar aapke muscle cell damage ho gaye hain stem cells would convert themselves into muscle cells for example in people with type 1 diabetes and those paralyzed by spinal cord injuries or multiple sclerosis 
अब जिन लोगों को टाइप वन डायबिटीज होता है उनके पास ये बीटा सेल्स नहीं होते बीटा और आईलेट सेल्स ऑफ लैंगर हैंड्स जो होते हैं प्रेजेंट इन दैंग्रियाबल होने के लिए क्यों नहीं जब इंसुलिन बनाने के लिए और वो ग्लूकागोन बनाने के लिए अल्फा सेल्स और बीटा सेल्स नहीं होते पेंक्रियाटिक सेल्स नहीं होते आईलेट सेल्स ऑफ लैंगर हैंड्स नहीं होते दोज पीपल नीड दी स्टेम सेल्स ताकि उनके अंदर स्टेम सेल्स जाए दोज स्टेम सेल्स कैन बी कन्वर्टेड इन टू दिल्स ऑफ दी आईलेट ऑफ लैंगर हैंड्स and then they can produce insulin and they can recover from type 1 diabetes further detail hum upcoming chapters mein bhi padhenge moreover another advantage is that bone marrow transplants are an example of an adult stem cell transplant and can be used to treat leukemia and other blood cell cancers moreover whole organ could be grown for transplants without the need for a donor aap organs bhi bana sakte hain by the help of stem cells and fourthly If organs are made from patients' own stem cells, there would be no need for tissue typing and no chance of organ rejection. Because if I tell you a very interesting thing, many people who are in need of organs, उनके साथ एक problem क्या आता है? Sometimes the organ does not match with the recipient. मैंने अब for example, you need a liver. Liver donor ने जो liver दिया है, that does not matches your blood type. आप क्या करेंगे? so it is important ki agar bande ke apne stem cell se wo liver ya organ develop ho jaye there would be no chance of organ rejection and the body would not be able to reject the organ kyunki wo aapke your own stem cell would have developed it along with some advantages we have also some disadvantages for example number 1 there are ethical concerns regarding using and then destroying embryos kya aap embryos ke andar stem cells kyun nikal rahe moreover scientists have seen that mutations can occur म्यूटेशन हम आगे पढ़ेंगे विच इज जीन एक जेनेटिक सीक्वेंस के अंदर जो चेंज आ जाता है दैट कैन रिजल्ट इन वेरियस डिजीजेज इज नोन एज म्यूटेशन दैट कैन अकर इन स्टेम सेल्स कल्चर्ड फॉर सेवरल जनरेशन मोर ओवर इट इज इम्पॉसिबल टू ऑप्टेन एम्ब्रियोनिक स्टेम सेल्स फ्रॉम अ पेशेंट एज दे हैव टू बी कलेक्टेड बिफोर बर्थ मोर ओवर डिफिकल्टीज इन फाइंडिंग सुटेबल स्टेम सेल डोनर अच्छा अब स्टेम सेल्स के लिए भी डोनर्स को आपने ढूंढना पड़ता है Every hospital has a list of the donors, but still, you have to find the perfect stem cell donor for yourself. And this is the end of your chapter of stem cells topic, and your cell structure chapter is here. End has been completed. Thank you.